at Leo Winner VIP TV down at uh, Middleton Arena with the one and only Cy Clayton and the young prodigy Alex Rutter. Team Rutter, isn't it, mate? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, uh, normally being uh, a mag between you there, but um, you are challenging for the Central Area title on, is it the 17th of That's September? Yeah, 12 weeks tomorrow it is. And where's that going to be at Victoria Warehouse, is it? Yeah, yeah Victoria Warehouse, Gase, Mikey Gomez, Junior. A lot, of, a lot, a lot of people are talking about this already, mate. It's a, yeah, it's a fight that everyone's getting excited about. Yeah, it's what I've needed. I've needed something like to just get my teeth into, and this is exactly what I want. So well, you've you've, you've moved camps now. You're down with Pat Barrett. How's yeah, it going down there? Really good, mate. Enjoying going to the gym, learning every day. There's something new that I'm doing in the gym every day, drilling. So I'm, I'm enjoying it. I've been there about six months now since January. Mm -hmm. I'm mm -hmm. on fire on doing it. The next fight for the Central Area title. So. I, I've, I must admit, mate, I, I've always liked you. You don't actually fight like people you expect you to. You're quite an aggressive little sod. But, Turns uh, out the pretty boy, doesn't he? You think he's going to box, but he does it. He gets in there and has a, has a non measuring competition every time. <laughs> <laughs> not, not doing that now, though. I'm sticking to me boxing. Say it every fucking time on camera, though. I'm sticking to me boxing next time. But. Well, this is a big, big step up for you in the fact that you're going to be fighting 10 rounds. Um, and you know, Gomez is well. He's obviously, it's his father's name, but yeah, he's a yeah. good, tough fighter. I know him from the amateur days when he was at uh, Bridgewater with my yeah, lately yeah, Whitehead, yeah, yeah. and uh, he's got a great engine on him, and he's a tough lad. Yeah, I've but I had a lot with Gomez when it, when I was not with Pat, and he was with Pat. Yeah, I was with, with my old, with one of my old coaches, and he used to bring him down. So I've done a lot of sparring with him, so I know how good he is, and I know I have to be in shape to to beat him. Like that, but I believe my best beats is best. So, well, what I was saying to you before early on, what I've been impressed with is the fact that you've been probably the most consistent you've been in the gym yeah, for yeah, almost yeah. nine months consistently yeah, now, well, well before Christmas. Yeah, yeah. You, you're normally always coming down with something or having yeah, to pull out because of illness. I was, like I've said before, I was working as well as trying to be a professional boxer, and you can't do it. It was like a hobby for me, mm. and now it's, it's my life, it's all I'm doing. So. If, if I can't do it now, I might as well go get my old job back. So if I'm not dedicated now, I might as well go get my old job. Yeah. Do that. No, I, I, it's a lot of people talking about. It's one I'm definitely looking forward to, and uh, I'm a little bit excited about it, mate, because it could be a right one. Yeah, it will be if I like the war. But if I stick to the boxing, I'll box dead off and they're over. But you've never done that in that fight before. Because I've had to. It's like I've said to Simon, time and time again. He said, "Why do you stick to your boxing?" Them fights, I know it sounds like they're not forgetting because I'm not. It's like I know I'm gonna win, mm -hmm. but now I've got to train out, and I've got to be at my best. So Thing is, as well, I was had nine fights, and nine yeah. fights, won them all. We're knocking on, we're knocking on Woody's door. We want to get on the big show. Let's put us on a crawler under guard, do something with it. No. He, he needs that break, doesn't he? So what does Steve Wood do? He's, he's dangled the carrot now, hasn't he? Yeah. You want to get on these shows, you're picking the fight. I'm texting him every hour of the day, we're tweeting him, we've got the fight. He's back to Alex now, it's Alex's time. Go in there, shine. Hopefully, you know, win the fight, get another defence. And then, you know, Alex deserves to be on these big shows. Only nine and up. Yeah, he's boxed a lot, you know, he's boxed a lot of journeymen and stuff like that. But kid deserves a break now, doesn't he? So, I think, I think you've earned it, mate. You've earned it, mate. Not yeah. deserves it, you earned it. Yeah. So, hopefully... Uh, we'll be chatting to you and you'll be turning up and uh, a little belt around your waist. Yeah, 100%. It's like a, these fights now, where the people will see the best of me, where I'm going to be nervous going into all my nine fights. I feel like I'm going sparring. Mm -hmm. but, but now, like now when, when the fight got announced and everyone was talking about it, I was getting butterflies. Mm -hmm. I said to you, didn't I say, yeah. I'm excited. Shadow boxing will be from the room. I've never been like that before, but. I've been shows with you here before times, people grabbing you tonight, yeah. so you're fighting Gomez, I've seen yeah. the post. Yeah, yeah. everyone you know, is talking about, about it. My, my so the Pat Barrett angle yeah. on it, the Polly Hurst and Most, and it's yeah. brilliant, isn't it? Yeah. So it's a crappy oh, fight. Yeah. All right, oh, yeah. Lads, good luck for oh, the 17th, yeah. and obviously I'll be seeing you before now. I'll come down to Pat and uh, catch up with both of you. Cheers, Lee. Take care.